This video describes the algorithmic design of ARCHICAD elements using ARCHICAD and the ARCHICAD Grasshopper connection. After launching Rhinoceros, type the word Grasshopper into the Rhino command line and hit Enter. To start the ARCHICAD Grasshopper connection, go to File, Interoperability, Grasshopper connection. A small floating pallet appears with the Start Connection button on it. Click to start the connection. A spinning green icon will indicate that the connection is live. In case you have multiple Grasshopper documents open, in File, Connect Document to ARCHICAD. You can list all opened Grasshopper documents and you can select the one you want to communicate with ARCHICAD. If you select an object in ARCHICAD that was created in Grasshopper, you can press the selected GH button and the components that created this ARCHICAD element will become green and selected in Grasshopper. Most components of Grasshopper ARCHICAD connection generate a detailed preview in Rhino, using colors that match those of the ARCHICAD model. However, generated library parts, object, window, door, display only a bounding box as a preview by default. To see a detailed preview of library parts in Rhino, turn on the detailed ARCHICAD preview toggle in Grasshopper's display menu. In order to create a new ARCHICAD element, you can select a component from the design panel or the document panel and place it on the Grasshopper canvas. All design components that generate ARCHICAD elements have an input called Synchronize. It is a Boolean type parameter which enables components to communicate with ARCHICAD. If a component synchronize parameter is set to true, changes made to that component will be synchronized with ARCHICAD automatically. Below are the inputs necessary to create the ARCHICAD element. If you hover the mouse over each input, a small panel appears explaining what kind of data is required. The last input is the Settings input, where you can connect a Settings component from the Settings panel. Each component has a corresponding Settings component. 